Your Highness, are you all right? I am unharmed. Oh, good. Being princess ain't all fancy dinners, huh? Gotta be hard carrying a whole country. Can it, Rosie? That's the Princess of Gallia you're talking to. No, it's quite all right. She speaks the truth. As scion of the Valkyrer, it is my fate to live and die for Gallia's well-being. Are you sure that isn't just your excuse, Your Highness? What? If you label the status quo fate, you can run from the responsibility of changing it. You too, Welkin. Have a little respect here. Every living thing in this world struggles to live and pass life on to a new generation. They use all the instincts and animal wisdom they can just to live that one day longer. That powerful animal will to live is... I think it's a beautiful part of nature. <sighs> Your Highness may be descended from Valkyra, and that may carry a burden. The old ways and traditions you follow may be important to uphold. But I hope that you won't throw away the will to live your own life because of them. That's enough, Welkin. Give it a rest. Perhaps it is as you say, and I have been running from responsibility unknowingly. It is indeed mine to consider my life's role within the Valkyrian bloodline. Y your Highness... I am most envious of your ability to speak your mind so frankly. But time enough remains to consider my role, by my own will. Thank you for your words, Lieutenant. Not at all. Uh. Wow! Even a princess's gut will wake up and say hi when it's empty. I... I am. Rumbling bellies are a clever bit of animal wisdom all humans share. Alicia, have we got anything to eat? You bet. I brought some of the cinnamon rolls I baked this morning. Here you are, Your Highness. Thank you kindly. I have not had such bread before, but it is quite agreeable. <laughs> I'm glad. All right. Let's get Her Highness back to the capital. <laughs>